And as we can see, some people still milling about there where Ashley is at the Charleston Marriott. Meanwhile, we are going to news to Macy McLeod, who is at the location where Leon Stavronakis and his supporters were a little bit earlier there tonight. Certainly a very difference in mood. Yeah, he conceded hours ago that party long since over, right, Macy? That's right. It is actually closed up here. You can see it's dark inside the building behind me. Everyone has gone home. And as you know, the votes are in and Leon Stavronakis is not the next mayor of Charleston. Now Stavronakis gave his gave his concession speech around nine o'clock tonight. And he said he called John Tecklenburg on the phone to congratulate him for becoming Charleston's new mayor. One thing Stavronakis emphasized in his concession was the loss of Mayor Joe Riley as a leader in Charleston. Stavronakis called Riley one of the greatest leaders in America and urged the community to come together behind John Tecklenburg. I need all of you to join me in saying that tomorrow morning the race is over and that it's all about Charleston, the work to do to deal with traffic, to deal with our schools, to deal with our future. And so I need all of you to help me work with our new mayor again to make Charleston the very, very best place that it can be moving forward. And Stavronakis says he is still a state representative for the Low Country and he is honored to continue serving the community in that capacity. Live in downtown Charleston, Macy McLeod, News 2. All right,